just do the thing. Stretches of the game. Teams are going to try to limit mistakes. That's from your own goal. They've got to find a way to get pressure in the front part of the field so it's not him running back and defending. Good work by Ian Anderson, assistant referee in his second MLS Cup to make that call. Wonga on the deck. Vela picks it up. Vela blocked. Kostok cleans it up in front of a cost from Martinez. Arango picks it up. Vela directing traffic. Sifuentes. Martinez the tackle. And he's going to go in the book for that, I would imagine. Or this Mike has only allowed four free K3 draw, the final MLS game that was played before COVID shut the world down in March of 2020. Alan Acosta stands over it as well, has delivered assists from free kicks of plenty for club and country. This is one also, John, you have to trust to make sure is set that he doesn't allow that extra window of opportunity. And you also want to keep your wall together. That's the biggest part. You can't let anything that's body height have your reflexes. And you hope that you're better than this man, Carlos Vela. Fake from Vela, it's a cost to off the wall, down it's a goal, LAFC lead! Well, they go with some deception, and I was talking about the wall. In this one, it comes a deflection off the wall. The wall jump. And is it the head of, it's off McLean in the end, and it deflects in past Andre Blake. You get a great look at it here. It's on frame, that's what you want to do. And it's so unfortunate for him, but he's turning his head, and it just deflects right into the back of the net for Jack McLean starting this final. And look, he's brave. He goes up, he doesn't shy away from it, he doesn't duck away, and it just takes a wicked deflection. In the back of the net, LAFC lead. You thought it was going to be Vela. It's Kellen Acosta that opens the scoring here in MLS Cup.